Police in South Jersey are searching for a motorcycle driving menace. They say the man was caught on surveillance video throwing nails onto driveways, causing unsuspecting motorists to get flat tires. Eyewitness News reporter Clee Bryan is live in Vineland with pictures of that suspected vandal that police want you to see. Cleve. Well, if you're having a hard time seeing this little nail, you're not alone. That's why about 20 people drove over hundreds of these nails here at the entranceway to a business in Vineland. And as I found out today, this isn't the first time this has happened. <laughs> Deflated and frustrated. That's the situation with employees at Compass Wirecloth in Vineland, thanks to these. Roofing nails spread across the entrance to the parking lot early Tuesday morning, blew out more than two dozen tires. What possesses people to do things like that? Violent police don't know why, but they're getting closer to who. They've released these surveillance pictures of a denim clad man on a motorcycle spreading nails at Saren Systems Inc., another business about two miles away, where the same type of nail incident damaged employees' vehicles last weekend. <laughs> Turns out the nail bandit has been to both places before. Four years in a row at Saren, three years at Compass, each time around Easter. First year, we were pretty sure it was a disgruntled employee that we had let go. Um, so we didn't pursue anything with the uh, local police. And then we were hit again uh, last year. And the same thing. It's been a real interruption for us. It's, uh, it could have caused some real harm to some people driving home. You see the plug still hanging out down here. Alan Seitz was one of the victims and with another coworker spent almost his whole shift Tuesday fixing tires. From 11 o'clock till the end of the day, we were plugging up tires like it was pet boys. Seitz says whoever spread the nails around is a twisted individual, but clever picking out roofing nails. The big head on it makes it want to flip up and go right into your tire. Rick Widras says the nail throwing biker bandit should pay for the tires he popped and get help. Mad at the world. You know, just mad at the world and just don't have anything better to do, I guess. Take, take a look again at this picture. If you recognize the man on the motorcycle that may have been responsible for spreading all these nails around at the businesses, please call Vineland Police. He could owe the uh, victims here thousands of dollars. Live and violent, I'm Cleve Bryan, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Cleve, thank you.